Once you've created your exercise, it can be helpful for your students if you add finger notation. To do this, go to the exercise you want to add finger notation to. Next, hover over the settings cog on the bottom right and click editor. Towards the bottom of this menu, click finger notation. To add finger notation, start by clicking a note on the piano roll. Then select what finger notation you want to add to the note. The left hand uses the light orange numbers from 5 to 1, starting with your pinky at 5 to your thumb at 1. The right hand uses the blue-gray numbers from 5 to 1, starting with your thumb at 1 to your pinky at 5. You can also use the numbers across the top of your computer keyboard to create notation. The finger notation is laid out on the computer keyboard in the same way that your fingers would be laid out on the piano. The 1 to 5 keys represent the left hand, with your pinky, your 5 finger, on the 1 computer key. And the 6 to 0 keys are for the right hand, with your right pinky, your 5, on the 0 computer key. To add notation using the keyboard, click on the note, then press the key associated with the finger notation you want to use. If you need to undo a round of changes, click the Undo Changes button to reset the notation to what it was on your most recent save. Keep in mind that if you're creating notation on an exercise for the first time, clicking Undo before hitting Save would get rid of your work. So be sure to click Save if you want to lock something in before making additional changes. You'll notice one other button that alternates between Display Notation and Hide Notation. If the button says display notation, it means that the finger notation you've made is currently hidden from the exercise. Clicking the button will make your notation publicly visible and swap the button's text to hide notation. Clicking the button again will make it disappear for students. If you need to clear multiple notes, select the notes in the piano roll and press clear. Once you have finished adding finger notation, Click the Save Changes button to save your work. 